Colegio de San Juan de Letran vows to help the victim's family and authorities in resolving the case of a 19-year-old student kidnapped by his own schoolmates. In a statement, Letran says it remains committed to the just resolution of this case, to cooperating with police efforts, to extending appropriate help to the family. Of the 10 suspects in the case, seven are students of Letran, including the alleged mastermind. The victim, whose name has been withheld, was abducted Wednesday. He was blindfolded for two days and bound by the wrists with duct tape. He did not eat or drink until he was rescued Friday. The abductors had allegedly asked for a 30 million peso ransom. No ransom was paid. So far, four suspects have been arrested by the police. Alleged mastermind Julius Atabay, Ferdinand de la Vega Jr., and Ralph Emmanuel Camaya. All three are Latran students. Another suspect arrested is Justine Mahipus from the College of St. Benilde. National Police Chief Oscar Albayade says the victim, along with his classmate Atabay, were waiting for a bus in Manila on August 1. They were taken by six unidentified armed men on board a white Toyota Innova. Atabay then called the family using the kidnapped student's phone. The victim's family called the police for help. Detectives found Atabay's story unusual. He didn't want to turn over the phone used in the negotiations. Kidnappers spoke to him and he relayed their messages to the victim's family, which is unusual. Upon interrogation, Atabay broke down and pointed the police to where his accomplices kept the Latran student. Operatives rescued the victim in Balutondo, Manila, Friday. Police say the three point to Atabay as a mastermind. They say Atabay promised them 50,000 pesos to 4 million pesos. The victim's family has not issued any statement to the public.